Hello everyone, this is Matt Spurk, the captain of Team Kraken. I want to introduce you to the new and improved Kraken BattleBot. This season we wanted to focus more on damage while still trying to maintain the Kraken look and feel. The team met several times this past summer to discuss all kinds of crazy ideas of what the new Kraken might ultimately end up looking. The team finally settled on a kinetic crusher, a vertical, vertical tooth disc, spinning weapon, uh, mounted to an overhead jaw. The jaw is able to rotate 120 degrees, enabling us to bite down on our opponents. It's also possible to run the jaw in the closed position and it'll function more like a four-wheel drive vert spinner. The redesign for this new Kraken was extensive. Every part was new and reworked. Here are some of the design details about the changes that we made. The frame is made of 3 16 AR500 plates. The front armor is now shock mounted on rubber mounts. And we've added additional side armor to cover over the wheels on the side. Speaking of those wheels, they're powered by four wheel drive hyperdrive motors from Team Hypershock. Uh, each motor chain drives the custom UHMW wheel with neoprene tread material over the top. The jaw weapon is a two tooth disc. The disc is half inch thick AR500 steel. It weighs 13 pounds and spins at 221 mile per hour. The weapon is mounted on custom aluminum pulleys which house dual spherical roller bearings and a hardened steel shaft. The jaw itself is connected to an NPC right angle gear motor through a three to one chain reduction. Now that system is able to produce over 300 foot pounds of torque. The weapon motors are dual hyperdrive motors coupled together with a custom pulley system. That pulley drives a V-belt out to the intermediate pulley and out to the teeth. After the functional elements of the bot were complete, it was time to turn the bot into Kraken. We added custom scaling, handmade eyes, and even the hand-forged teeth. Kraken was ready to go. The team was excited to get the redesigned bot tested and through safety. Be sure to watch BattleBots this week to see how the new bot performed and stay tuned for more videos from the Team Kraken.